Oh, well, no, I don't think it's going to be about the decision. It's going to be about the recommendation toward the European Commission because they need to come with the plan. We definitely need to push on the Commission to come uh, with, this, uh, with the proposal very quickly. It's really the urgency is very high. Everybody is waiting for, for, the, for, for the price bubble uh, to be broken, so definitely, yes. Well, honestly, I think right now uh, the, the biggest focus for the Europe uh, is first of all the energy crisis, which is very much related to the conflict Ukraine, uh, basically Russian aggression on Ukraine. That's where we have to put the, the, the maximum effort and uh, of course we need to have this resolved globally but this is where it's all around so we had uh, yesterday the the president of turkey on our european uh, political community community meeting which was very important to have him here and i'm glad that we, he could uh, we could speak on the perspective of of the europe or from the from the perspective of europe and uh, really understand how uh, each country plays an important role to resolve this whole situation uh, under the principles of European Union, rule of law, sovereignty and, uh, and integrity, territorial integrity. These are the values that we in Europe live and these are the, val the best values for any citizens and also the citizens of European Union. Uh, well, I wouldn't. I, I wouldn't say it's, it was kind of overlapped with the situation that we have currently. That that's because right now, uh, some because the the energy crisis in such an extensive wave uh, touching our lives, then you you don't seem. It seems that you don't see the other layers levels. So uh, that's why when you look. Everybody is speaking about resolving this is first. If we do that for the upcoming six months, then we can go back to the topics that we're dealing with uh, from the short, mid term and long term. So we'll get to that. But right now we have to deal with uh, providing security uh, and safety for our citizens uh, during the winter and the, and the spring. Excuse me? Yeah, well, we, you have to look at it from the from the perspective of uh, common sense. Europe, in first place, needs enough gas. We cannot have a solution that will cut uh, deliveries of gas because if we don't have any gas, it doesn't matter what it costs if you don't have it. So that's the first principle you have you have to watch. And then, when we can uh, guarantee enough gas for the winter and the spring, then we can speak to get it as low as possible. But you have to look for this special marginal level. So it doesn't break and it doesn't, uh, it, uh, it doesn't cause that the suppliers will say, okay, we'll deliver somewhere else. We, we have to avoid it. So uh, and, uh, to find the exact uh, level, the price level, that's what the experts should do. And they should do it very quickly. Everybody's waiting for that. Will Europe solidarity hold in this energy crisis? Excuse me? Will Europe solidarity hold in this energy crisis? It must. There is, I mean, we cannot survive without the solidarity. That's very important. But the solidarity must be done based on exact calculations. Each country needs to do the homework and see uh, what is their consumption, what is their capacity of savings, and what is the gap in between. And then we have to speak how we can help each other. Because on one hand, I, I'm very thankful to all the citizens, but also companies who are already reducing their consumption, because there is a great potential. And uh, we have to do this not only in the, within the nations, but among the nations. So we know because, for, for example, Slovakia is a very industrial country. We consume a lot of electricity and gas in our factories. If we shut them down, the people will lose their employment, their job, their salaries, etc. So we have to be very careful on that. Have you got, already a, 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 have you got an agreement with Austria concerning gas storages? Uh, we, 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 don't, we don't need to have an agreement because we have our own gas storage, Austria has uh, own gas storage, so the storage is not the, the case, uh, especially, especially between Austria and Slovakia, so we, we don't need to discuss that. Do you think that 